guys welcome back to the channel um, I'm going to do a flip through of this unicorn coloring book for kids aged four to eight now this is not for Jennifer this is for me because I wanted uh, some simple um, unicorns to color so I picked up this one uh, it's uh, just lovely it's by coloring book Kim um, I just wanted some cute little unicorns to color with my markers or my piggy what's it pens gel pens so, and they, they are so cute I mean look at this how adorable is this you'll probably hear Paul in the background that's fine little fairy oh she's off I mean look yeah they're simple but they're just nice I mean I'm quite happy to sit here with some crayons or some markers I'm gonna color with these little gorgeous little unicorns Even the sun's smiling. So it's thin paper, but you know, it's not bad. I mean, it's better than the paper I remember we had in colouring books when I was a kid, which was almost like, I don't know, it was really weird, sort of brownie paper. Weird paper, but this is so much better than the stuff we had when I was growing up. <laughs> Adorable. I mean, how cute is that? Come on now. She's the unicorn is running on a rainbow, and there are castles in the sky. Oh, that is gorgeous. I mean, look at it. These are just such cute little unicorns. Yeah, these are so cute. I mean, look at that little frog. Just take it out like that's it. <laughs> these are so gorgeous considering it's a kids book I really love it I, I can see me colouring in this one maybe we'll do our colouring chat you never know <laughs> well, we will be doing colouring chats I've got some plans now when I'm going to be doing them so. and I'll explain why it's so hard to do them it'll be easier in September anyway look at that little princess it's so cute and that one I just think these are lush. They're just nice simple line drawings and they're just so cute. Look <laughs> at the squirrels. They got acorns in the I just I wish I could draw. Even simple stuff like this I can't draw. I wish I could. There's certainly enough pages in here. <laughs> that one wearing a rubber ring. It's gonna go swimming. <laughs> I just think they're adorable. Look at that. I do, I think they're lovely. <laughs> oh, it's sort of like a St. Patrick's Day one almost. Well, it's sort of like a cross between St. Patrick's and Valentine's Day. It's got a little pot, which would be a pot of gold at the end of the rainbow. But they got hearts coming out of it. That is so adorable. Oh, look at that cute little snail. It's in a pumpkin. And there is a pumpkin coach. It's so simple, this one, but you know, it's going to look gorgeous. So, that one looks so happy. In fact, this whole book makes me feel so happy as well. It really does. It's just a happiness book, this is. It's just, oh, so cute and sweet, and oh, it's just amazing. We're near the end now. <laughs> I 
I mean, look how happy that one is. It just, doesn't that just make you want to smile? The baby one. There's a little baby unicorn sitting on a flower. And that is the last one in the book. So that is uh, the unicorn colouring book for kids ages four to eight. Even though no, I'm 48, I'm going to be colouring it by Colouring Book Kim. I think it's adorable. I really like it. And I am going to be colouring it very, very soon. And if you want me to do a colouring chat in this book, let me know, leave me a note in the comments down below and I will happily do that for you. I've just got to move the books away from the cat because she tends to nibble the edges, don't you? Yes, you do. You're a good kitty cat, aren't you? Right, so that's it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed these, this flip through. I'm going to try and do a flip through of every single book I get from now on. Um, mainly so you can see them and you can see if you want me to colour in them and also because it keeps the channel going when I can't make videos. I'm going to give you a full update on why it's difficult to make videos at the moment in our next colouring chat. Which might be, I might do it tonight, it might be up tomorrow, you never know. I'm fingers crossed. I'll see you very very soon. Bye now!